Good morning. Welcome to the Pray Mom with PT. It's a prayer session designed specifically to pray for your children. Bible says in the book of Isaiah chapter 59 verse 21. As for me, says the Lord, this is my covenant with them. My spirit is upon you and my words which I have put in your mouth shall not depart from your mouth, nor from the mouth of your descendants nor from the mouth of your descendants' descendants, says the Lord, from this time and forevermore. This is the word of God unto you today. I just want you to lift up your voices and say, God, I thank you for the covenant that you have with me. I thank you for your spirit that is upon me this morning. I pray for an outpour of your spirit upon my household this morning. In the name of Jesus, let the words that you have spoken, O God, not depart from my mouth. In the name of Jesus, nor the mouth of my descendants, nor the mouth of my descendants' descendants, nor the mouth of my children and my children's children. In the name of Jesus, I ask that you be with me, Lord, forever, now and forevermore. Be with my household now and forevermore. In the name of Jesus, I give you praise, Daddy, this morning. I exalt you this morning. I give you honor and I worship you. In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. Amen and amen. We have been praying using the letters A to Z. Is episode 11. This morning, we are going to continue with the letter O. And this morning, I've titled O, orderliness. This morning, we are going to be praying for orderliness. Orderliness is about habits. These are simple things that our children do, simple habits that they do, like their rooms being untidy, not managing time. This morning, we want to pray because it's important. We want to pray that in the name of Jesus, our children will be orderly. In the name of Jesus, Bible says in the book of 1 Corinthians chapter 14, verse 40, Bible says, but everything should be done in fielding and orderly, in an orderly way. It says it should be done in fitting and in an orderly way. This morning, lift up your voices with me and pray that your children will not be disorganized. In the name of Jesus, they will be orderly. In the name of Jesus, they will prepare themselves, prepare their surroundings so that they can achieve the greatest efficiency in anything that they do. Lift up your voices with me this morning. Orderliness, very important. Orderliness means ensuring that the, the place that they that they are staying, everything is in, 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 in line in the name of Jesus, that so that they will be able to reach their goals. In the name of Jesus, pray with me this morning. Raku rekebo Help my children, help my grandchildren to be orderly in the name of Jesus. Lift up your voices with me. Are you praying this morning? Pray with me. Help my children to be orderly in the name of Jesus. Let them, oh God, that everything will be in place. Their rooms will be tidy. Their surroundings, they will make sure everything is tidy and in orderliness. In the name of Jesus, keeping their uniform in an orderly way, keeping their lockers, their decks, their wardrobe in an orderly way. All these things, are, they are least, they might be little, but it goes a long way in the lives of a, ch- of a child. Pray with me this morning. Rakabo shikariga. Rekebo sotoriande bo sotoriande. I pray for orderliness for my son this morning. I pray for orderliness for my daughter this morning, my grandchildren. In the name of Jesus, let them be orderly. Let them respect the moments that they need to be quiet. This is part of orderliness. Listening to instruction, following instruction in classes, even at home, in at school. Come on, pray with me this morning. Rakebo Sotoriande, putting things back where they belong to. This is part of orderliness. You want to pray with me this morning? There is nothing too small to pray about. Come on, lift up your voices with me this morning and pray that your children will be orderly. In the name of Jesus, Rakebo Sotoriande, help me as a praying mom to encourage my children to be orderly. In the name of Jesus, help me as a praying mom to encourage them to be responsible, to teach them responsibility. In the name of Jesus, help me as a praying mom to encourage my children and my grandchildren to be consistent. In the name of Jesus, Rakebo Sotoriaraba. 
Rakebos Sotoriande, having a, having a routine bedtime and a wake up time is part of orderliness. In the name of Jesus, pray with me this morning. Rakebos Sotoriande, help my son, help my daughter to learn to have good habits. In the name of Jesus, learning to prioritize time management. In the name of Jesus, help my children, oh God. In the name of Jesus, help me as a pray mom to be an example to my children and know God that they will strive to be more orderly. In the name of Jesus, pray with me this morning. Lift up your voices. Titus chapter 2 verses 3 to 5. Bible says, Older women likewise be of be, likewise are to be referenced in behavior, not slanders or slaves to too much wine. They are to teach what is good. And so train the younger women to be to love their husbands and children, to be self-controlled, pure, working at home. In the name of Jesus, lift up your voices. All these things are important. That God help me as a pray mom, as an older one, that God has put me in charge of these children. Help me to be able to teach them. In the name of Jesus, to, to be to reference, help me to teach them to be good. Help me to train them. Give me grace. Give me strength, oh God, to train my children and my grandchildren to be self-controlled, to be pure, to be able to do housework. In the name of Jesus, pray with me this morning. Rakusa tu taliga rutaruto riande. P. P is for prophetic families. Prophetic families. This morning you want to pray. Bible says in the book of Second Timothy chapter 3 verse 16, all scripture is breath upon by God and profitable for teaching, for reproof, for correction and for training in righteousness. Lift up your voices with me. It's prophetic families. In the name of Jesus, Rakebo, the word of God is prophetic. The word of God is come, that comes out of the, the mouth of God. In the name of Jesus, concerning your family this morning, we are praying for prophetic, the prophetic word of God over your household. In the name of Jesus, Rakebo Sotoriande. Let the gifts of the Holy Spirit be released in abundance to the every member of my family this morning. In the name of Jesus, prophetically I declare this morning, in the name of Jesus, that the word of God come to my household this morning. In accordance to his word of in his word in the book of Psalm 107, verse 20. In the name of Jesus, Father, I pray. In accordance to your word in the book of Acts 13, 14, 49, this morning the word of God will be spread read out among my family in the name of Jesus, in the lives of my children and my grandchildren in the name of Jesus, in accordance to your word in the book of 2 Kings 2016, my family will hear the word of God in the name of Jesus, the word of God over my family is right and all his work is done in truth, prophetically this morning I declare the word of God in the name of Jesus the word of God is proven in my family, is proven in the lives of my children and is a shield to all of us who trust in him. In the name of Jesus Rakebo Sotoriande pray with me this morning Rakebo Sotoriande in accordance to the word of God in 1 Kings 22 verse 5 my family and my children will inquire for the Lord for, for the word of God today. In the name of Jesus prophetic Rakebo Sotoriande Ratusatutalinda my family family will not suffer a famine of hearing the word of God. In the name of Jesus, prophetically this morning I declare that my family will not suffer hearing of, of, of hearing the word of God in accordance to the word of God in Amos 8 11. In the name of Jesus, pray with me this morning. In accordance to your word in Jeremiah 6 10, Lord, I pray that my children and my family, oh God, shall give it to the word of God. In the name of Jesus, Rakabo Sotoliga, Ratsusa Tutaliande, Rekebo Shikariga, Ratsotobo Sotoriande. 
the word of the Lord is with my family and we make intercession to the Lord of hosts this morning in the name of Jesus pray with me I declare the prophetic word of the Lord to be released over my household this morning to be released over my children this morning in the name of Jesus Lord put your words in the mouth of my seed and my seed seeds in the name of Jesus put your words into the, into the, into, into the mouth of my children and my children's children in the name of Jesus let my children speak your word with confidence and with boldness in the name of Jesus let the spirit of prophecy be released upon my family this morning in the name of Jesus father we give you praise come and give him glory give him praise his word is effective over your destiny over the destinies of your children this morning in Jesus mighty name we prayed Amen and amen. Thank you so much for joining me again this morning. This podcast is brought to you from International Prayer and Liberation Ministry, IPAM, for godly counseling and prayers for your relationships and for your children. You can contact me on my WhatsApp or email me at dpmom at iprayerandliberation.site. I would love to hear from you. Please send me your testimonies and your prayer requests. Send them to my email, dpmom at iprayerandliberation.site. Dot site. If you do not receive this podcast directly from me and you would love to, we have a WhatsApp group for the Pray Mom with PT. Please email me to get an invite link to this group. We have a, an Instagram account. If, you, if you're on Instagram, please connect with us on social media. The Instagram is the Pray Mom with PT. If this podcast has been a blessing to you, please share with someone. God bless you and bye for now.